seen a locomotive on the move in Greenville County today, and the train has come to a stop. As WYFF News 4's Allison Powell reports, the train's new permanent home is on the Swamp Rabbit Trail. It's a little train that could and will. It will bring Berea back. A big task for a small locomotive like this one. But Berea native Beverly Sutton believes this train can. It will bring awareness to Berea, make people remember what Berea used to be. Built in the 1940s, this locomotive wasn't too far from going to the scrapyard. That's when David Wilkerson bought it. Very important to me to preserve history. Wilkerson's company, Motive Power and Equipment Solutions, built and renews cars like this one. It was in a mine in, in Arizona, and it was in a copper mine, and all they did was shift one little car back and forth. It was an ingot full of copper, and that's all the job this thing ever did at that plant. It was there for 20 years. Once he got it here, they got to work on removing the engine and transmission and painting the outside. The donated locomotive will go right here beside this rail car that was refurbished about two years ago by the same company. That's in the portion of the Swamp Rabbit Trail that's in Berea, just off of Sulphur Springs Road. Fitting because Wilkerson grew up just down the street and has history on the trail. I was the last person to drive a locomotive on that track before it was taken up. A little piece of history Berea residents are hoping will inspire the future. Allison Powell, WIFF News 4, in Berea.